to me, celebration means that it is a time for us just to get together and uh, honor people when they uh, complete or succeed in something. Uh, there's been times in our life when we just uh, was ne never able to succeed, and uh, now we're starting to persevere through Christ, and so uh, we're able to get together as a, a group here and uh, just honor each other for making it through this ministry. If you would stand as we continue to worship. It's about being there celebrating um, my brothers who I laughed and um, cried and, and struggled with and the long hours and seeing them just just so full of joy and being joyful for them because I know what they've been through. It just it, it gives me hope just to see how happy these guys are and uh, just be able to see that they have opportunities to share Christ with others. Good morning, my name is Tom Thompson with The Refuge. Um, this morning we're excited for this portion of the service to be about a celebration. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. are transforming. They're coming from addiction to full transformation by God's grace. And so what that looks like is coming in, a lot of them homeless, totally um, just addicted, and their lives are overrun and riddled with all the effects that drug abuse would bring. 13 months later, some of these guys will finish and complete. They're completely different people. And so what we're doing today is we're celebrating what God's done in them. Being here for them and their day of, of graduating and moving on in life and, and having a, a a sense of peace knowing that they can rest in Christ. Um, I, there's, there's no greater joy than seeing somebody who's been through this ministry and, and know that they had the tools that they need, that God's going to be there for them so they can succeed in life. Love came down and rescued me. Love came down and set me free. Now I am yours. I am forever yours. What I have to be able to do to be able to get to phase four, uh, just uh, dig in and uh, grow a deeper relationship with God and uh, just be able to continue walking with integrity, just being able to be honest and authentic with everybody. Um, I'm in phase three. This is the start of my third week and uh, I'm really excited to get to phase four because I've never really completed nothing. So by me staying here in this ministry and completing it, it'll be the first time I've completed something in a long time. And I'm just ready to get to phase four so I can uh, build a stronger relationship with Christ, uh, get a job, save money. I've never uh, took steps as a man to uh, actually have something. So uh, that'll be the, this will be the first time for that. And I'm really excited just to, to move on and start a life. It all started here in terms of what happens on Monday morning. Men come in here broken, looking for hope, looking for what they don't know at the time. They think they just want to get off drugs. And then we do the bait and switch, and Jesus comes in, and he does his thing. Um, so, but they come here on Monday mornings. They come to a place of, of willingness, and are we ready to truly change and allow God to do his miracle work in our hearts? Why we do what we do should be because of our love for him, and first of all, his love for us. That's why we do what we do. So that's the place of really digging in deep into the heart in terms of receiving all of his healing, receiving all of his forgiveness, receiving his salvation, and most importantly, receiving him. Amen. 